Hello beautiful people of YouTube and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Noye and I'm a Nigerian teacher. Africa. Welcome to my channel. If you're seeing me for the very first time, I'm super excited to also have you join this family. So please click on the subscribe button. That's where you can be a member of this beautiful youtube channel and if you're a returning subscriber i'm super happy i'm glad that you came back to watch my channel so in this video i'm going to be talking basically on how to just earn salary in december okay how to earn salary plus christmas bonus what to just take home in december basically and the focus is on private schools in another video i'm going to be talking about teachers salaries in nigeria but for the purpose of this video i'm just going to be talking about what teachers are going to take home in this december for private schools so if you're a geography teacher a social studies teacher or somebody who generally likes to get informed thank you for tuning in school for the purpose of this video i'm just going to be using a hundred thousand naira as the skill now so let me issue this disclaimer i'm not saying that the minimum salary paid in private schools is a um, hundred thousand and i'm not saying that that's the maximum but for the purpose of this video i'll just be using a hundred thousand naira for us my example <laughs> the reason why i'm stating this category is because i know that some people would want to say that they heard a youtuber say that hundred thousand is the minimum amount paid so i needed to clarify that so the first school i observe will pay to hundred thousand naira full salary another hundred thousand are called 13th one then christmas bonus sometimes the christmas bonus is monetized or the christmas bonus is um, given in form of material stuff or food items basically something that you can use for to celebrate christmas with your friends or with your family and it's basically maybe with a bag of rice which is 50 kg in size or half bag of rice which is 25 kg in size or a quarter bag which is 12.5 kg so depending on the kind of school that it is so you get um, a full salary you get the 13th month which is also a full salary and then you get your christmas bonus so if you teach in schools like that then oh my goodness this december is going to be wow for you so that's for school within that country and it depends on the school there is nobody or there's no law regulating what you pay teachers in private schools in december so that's for school number one for school number two you'll find them earn their full salary 13th month which is half of their salary they get like half of their salary as 13th month so if they earn a hundred thousand they get fifty thousand naira added to it that's a hundred and fifty thousand naira plus christmas bonus that's school number three school number five full salary then they just get christmas bonus so if you teach in such schools well you still got something in some schools they pay you half of your salary and then christmas bonus and you're wondering why would they pay half their reason is that the teachers have worked for only a half the month so schools uh, most schools in this part of the world vacated around the 13th of december so they just say that okay you worked for half of the month that's like 15th of december which is half of 13 months you did not work for the full month you, so instead of being paid a hundred thousand you're supposed to get fifty thousand and so because they just want you to smile and not get upset blah 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 they package christmas bonuses in form of whatever it is and they give to this just all the monetize the christmas bonus so in other words if that's your earns a hundred thousand they give you to give you like fifty thousand naira and then Christmas bonus. So, so sometimes they may just monetize that Christmas bonus and add it to your salary. They may just add it up and make it um, twenty thousand naira or ten thousand or five thousand naira and add it to your fifty thousand to make it seventy thousand, so that it not even feel so bad that you, you didn't take your full salary home. But for me, I think that teachers should get their full salary. So that's for this school. And then the final school, which I really do not like, I see that happen. It's happening. It's no news. There are teachers who work in these schools that have told me about their school and about um, how they earn their salary some of them say that they haven't paid them for a period of time so when it's December they just um, put up a, a certain amount of money not up to their salary and they hand it over to them and say okay we don't want you to go home without anything just take this next year January we'll see what we can do about the balance of what we owe you hmm. I need somebody to get me a key for schools like that 
please get me king for schools like that although i, I understand that um, the government has done private schools a lot of dissatisfaction it's really not easy, easy. the policies are not even favoring owners of private schools if it seeks to listen to owners of private schools i wish i could do a video very soon to bring a school owner who would analyze what it is to run private schools in nigeria man it's not easy if you ask me some of them lament a whole lot i understand that then some of them complain about the fact that school fees are not paid promptly as and when due by parents i understand that totally nigeria itself is not helping the economy of the nation itself is not even favoring school owners so it's really very crazy out there so most of what happens to these school owners affects the teachers so that's why some of these schools they get to pay teachers very well especially the way they would want to but then there are still some very self let's say this let's call it spade a spade and not an agriculture equipment or a building too there are some schools for some school owners who aren't being fair so i'm just trying to be balanced who aren't also being fair so if you owe somebody it's your duty and your responsibility to pay them what you owe so on that note i think i want to wrap up this video and the reason why i did this video is just to get you informed just to let us know that okay this is what happens in december is the season this is what happens in december to teachers to some teachers not to all teachers but then i'm not going to put a statistic or a figure to um what what happened but the truth is that it happens until i come your way in another video do not forget to click on the subscribe button tap on the notification bell that way you get notified when i drop my next video have a merry christmas and a fantastic year 2020 ahead bye for now if you are new to my channel click on the subscribe button tap on the notification bell like it comment and share thank you